Hey Finn, what does a cow say when walking backwards? I don't know, Tarn, what? Oom, um, oom, um, oom. Um. Ah. Good morning, Sandpoint High School. Today for lunch, we have chicken fritter with a side of pasta alfredo. There is a boys soccer game today versus Lake City. Game begins at four. There's also a girls soccer game at Mead High School. The game begins at four and the bus departs at 1.30 p.m. There's a JV2 volleyball game at Timberlake High School. The games begin at five and the bus departs at 3.15. It's a go dog day. Oh, hold on, hold on a second, Mike. I gotta get this. Yeah. All right, come on in. Uh, cool. Yeah. Thanks. Do you got a minute, Mr. D? I do. Yeah, actually. I do. I do. Right. What's up? Nice. I have an idea for a video. You do? I okay. Do. Yeah. Great. We need yeah. some ideas. Okay. So, you know how you and I were talking about how students have all these things going on, right? Yeah, and then how to get that out there, right? Or what yeah. they what kind of usable skills they could do to exactly yeah yeah so they have they have schoology and tell that tells them all about their academics right yeah but what about other stuff like what if they get after school <laughs> detention for truancy well let's hope none of them do yeah right? man, you know what of course they will but okay. after school detention or maybe the counselors need to communicate with them sure. about scholarships or something specifically yeah. with a certain kid yeah. how do they know about that we, right now we're sending all these notes and it's like yeah well I'm drowning in paper what could streamline it absolutely yeah so what, yeah. Do, what do you think so I'm thinking every kid has an LPOSD email and calendar account, right? Yeah. So if we send them emails and calendar requests, it's right there. It's right there. And they've got but, Chromebooks, right? But the problem is, is they don't always check it, right? Yeah. Good point. So how, you know, what's what's going to change that? That's where the video comes in. Ooh, nice. Right? Okay. We make a video okay. that notifies students that they need to be checking that school email and that school calendar at least once a week. I would say probably better to be like two or three times a week, right? Yeah. Because if they're absent on a Monday and then they don't find out about the after school detention until a Wednesday and it can be confusing. So yeah. two or three times a week, huh? That sounds pretty good. So we yeah. probably need to borrow a camera from Mr. Love. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Do we need to, do you think we should play the parts in the movie or in the, video, in the film or? I don't know. We don't want to over overplay that, you know? Probably not. Yeah. It's probably not a good idea. But, you know, and our acting is, is really good. It might, you know, That's true. intimidate a few people on how good yeah. it is. So, yeah. okay, well, um, no, but I like that idea. So okay. just get in the habit of checking emails. Exactly. Every Monday and seeing if there's any obligations that they might need to take care of, right? Yep, yep, you actively using those email and calendar tools. Yeah, sounds good, let's do it. Okay, awesome. Great.
Aloha, we are your 2016-2017 Cedar Post Multimedia Editors. I'm Patrick Rockwell. And I'm Tarin McLaughlin. And if you have any fire jokes, please send them to me or Pat, and we'll get them in the announcements for you. It's a great day to be a Bulldog.